A very happy happy morning to all my dear children. Welcome back to your GK class. Dear children, today in GK we are going to see your last chapter that is your chapter number 21 naturopathy. Okay, this is your last chapter for this semester. Okay, after that we will see the test paper. Okay, dear kids, as a part of your revision. Now today, let us see this chapter with the help of a video, dear kids. Okay. Chapter 21, Naturopathic, Health and Fitness. Aloe vera, it is used to heal burns, wounds and other skin diseases. Now, for what purpose aloe vera is used? It is used to heal the wounds, the burns and many other skin diseases yes if you are having any skin disease just rub the aloe vera on your skin dear children okay it will cure you okay so now in textbook also you are having the exercise related to this so in that blank what you have to write aloe vera yes it is used to heal wounds or burns and any other skin diseases okay so what is used aloe vera is being used okay dear kids garlic it is used to boost the immune system and reduce blood pressure and cholesterol level now for what purpose garlic is used it is used to boost our immune system Yes, and to reduce the cholesterol level in our body. When we eat too much of oily foods in our daily diet, yes, with that, our cholesterol level is getting higher and higher. Okay, so that is bad for our health. So, at that time, we can eat garlic. Okay, we can eat garlic to reduce our cholesterol level. Okay, dear kids. Ginger. It is used to reduce pain and has a warming effect. It prevents cold and stomach ulcers. Now, ginger is used when we are having cold. Yes, at that time, your mother makes some kara at home when we are feeling, when we are having cold and cough. Yes, dear children. So, for curing our cold cough what is used ginger is being used okay what is used ginger so in that blank you will write ginger okay to see it is used to cure fever respiratory disorders asthma lung disorders stress and poor dental hair now, tulsi is used for so much purposes, for dental care, for stress, for respiratory disorder, asthma and many other things like that, even for fever as well. Okay, so we all are having a plant of tulsi at home. So, whenever you are having some fever, so what you will eat? You will eat 4 to 5 leaves of tulsi. Okay, dear kids? So, Tulsi you will write in your next blank. Okay. Peppermint. It is used to relieve headache, boost energy, reduce stomach aches and improve digestion. The next one and the last one is peppermint. Okay. Now, if you are having some digestion problem or if you are having stomach ache, you must eat peppermint okay dear kids yes so you got all the remedies the household remedies okay dear kids now let us see the know the fact know this also lemon is used to treat scurvy and prevent cold and flu it helps in digestion and reducing pain and swelling lemon is being used to prevent scurvy as well and it too is also used in digestion reducing pain and swelling now let us see real life fact real life prefer naturopathy to avoid the side effects of allopathy you should prefer naturopathy naturopathy means that the remedies which we have seen now so that 
to avoid the side effects of allopathy allopathy is medicines okay we must yes we must prefer naturopathy okay dear kids now let us see the quiz time quiz time tick the correct answers which of the following is used to prevent arthritis which of the following is used to prevent arthritis that is your answer pineapple citrus fruits like orange are used to prevent citrus fruits like oranges are used to prevent scurvy okay yes dear kids i hope you have done the exercise and the quiz time while watching this video lesson okay dear kids now we will meet next time with something more interesting in gk till then bye bye all god bless you take care